Besides thanking you for coming tonight, I should also thank you for being part of a big experiment. For that's what nuclear facts is, an experiment. And it's the culmination of a, a year-long experiment, which is to invest in partnerships, in, in researchers who have voluntarily come forward with ideas for using nuclear science and technology to benefit community. And the experiment has been to enable that research to happen and be sure to provide the community with an opportunity to meet some of those researchers, to hear what they're doing, to see the impacts that they see and to catch a feeling of the passion they have in devoting their skills and attention to various topics, medicine, materials, energy and the environment, but using nuclear science and technology to tackle these big issues. This is a novel way that the Fedoric Center hopes to build a kind of a conversation between researchers and the community, that there would be a growing of understanding, the ability to hold reasonable conversation, and some feedback from the community to the researchers and to the Fedoric Center to give some direction to where things might go in the future. So what does this all add up to? The Fedoric Center is working to build a network of experts centered in Saskatchewan with partners around the world. The work done by these experts, be it through scientific and social academic research, training students, or providing policy advice to government, along with the facilities the Fedoric Center will run directly, all of this is intended to provide opportunities for Saskatchewan people to create, interpret, and apply knowledge leading to new discoveries, technological advancement, and economic opportunity. At the same time, the Fedoric Center and the experts we support aim to increase awareness and understanding of the pros and cons of nuclear technology through fact-based discussions with the people of Saskatchewan, and that is why we are here tonight. Very, very important to the Fedoric Center that we place Saskatchewan among global leaders. That's our mission. We can't do that by just congratulating ourselves on how smart we are and doing a little bit of internal research. We have to talk to people who are outside Saskatchewan where the global leaders are and be part of that community. That happens through partnerships. So it's very important in the Fedoric Center that when proposals come forward, there are meaningful partners brought by the project proponent, the person proposing the project. We want them to bring in partners. We want them to show that the Saskatchewan-based leader has brought in somebody else who's also interested in this project. And that is our way of engaging and being a part of that global community of research, training, and development in the nuclear domain. So we will definitely hope that our Saskatchewan-based leaders will find partners outside of Saskatchewan and bring them to the table with a meaningful contribution of their own to the research that's being done, funded in a base way by the Fedoric Center. That's our goal. That's a very strong one.